What's going on, everybody? Z here, and welcome to a new game. Welcome to a free game. That's right, this is a free game for all of you amazing people that need some free games in your life. We're checking out Mr. Mind today. Now, it's not completely brand new, but it's, it's been updated. And I saw it, and it reminded me of like an old Flash game that I used to play. Yes, Flash game, not IO game. Flash game, I know, it's old. But anyways, we're going to check it out. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. It looks super neat. It looks super cool. And it's like a mining kind of game. So it kind of starts off as like a, it's like a clicker-ish. Yeah, let's just get into it. Um, Thoughtless Miner, that sounds good. Let's go ahead and create a new world here. And basically all we're doing, is there any sounds here? Okay, we got some sound effects. Um, so basically all you do is you, you're going to start off by having like to do some clicking, right? So we're going to do some clicking here. And we're going to get the coal. And then we're eventually going to sell it once it's... There we go. Perfect. We're going to go ahead and we're going to start selling that to make some money. Now, what's going to what's going to be nice is obviously we're going to get some automation stuff going here because like what's a clicker game without some automation, right? Exactly. So let's go ahead and sell that and let's get our first miner, which is going to be mining uh, basically right here. Now, the next hire is 250 and then so on and so forth. They get more and more expensive, uh, but they're basically just going to passively mine. Um, like as you know as you would expect and then over here we have our drill that is slowly drilling down and obviously the deeper we go the better things get and there's like actually like bosses and like new worlds and things like that it gets kind of crazy it gets kind of crazy so um yeah we're starting it up we're doing the things doing stuff now uh once you buy like your first miner basically this is miner slot one two three four five so on and so forth so every time you go down a level, not only are you getting um necessarily like more resources per minute because of just how fast you know they're mining but you're also getting more levels uh and so like you get more miners and actually if you look you can see your capacity till full so right now we can only hold a thousand resources it says 18 minutes to 24 seconds now even just going down by a level that's going to uh that's going to decrease that time and then adding more miners is also going to decrease that time so if we go into cell here uh we don't have 250 yet Let's go in here. It wants me to do some basic things first. Uh, steam engine drill speed plus 80%. Let's go ahead and get that. So that's going to make our drill 80% faster. Now, the deeper you go, the slower it's going to take or the, the longer it's going to take. So like that's 80% right now. But I mean, once we get down to like, you know, 15, 20, 30, 40, whatever, it's going to be so slow. So like upgrades are going to be like super key there. But as you can see now, um, even though I didn't buy any additional miners, our capacity to, well, hold on, actually, let's just sell that first. Our time till full e is now 12 minutes. So just by drilling down and having these miners going, uh, huge help. So let's get some more of these going. Let's get some more miners going. Um, we got to talk to this guy. Basically, there's like achievements here to get tickets. Um, and then you can use tickets on something where you can buy tickets for something. Let's see, use tickets. Uh, we got crates and chests. So let's hold on. Let's you know what? Let's buy one of these. Open the chest. What do we got? You got a five minute time lapse. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> I mean, that's cool. <laughs> that is cool. But uh, actually, that is. I mean, that is actually kind of cool. That was that was actually kind of nice. Um, so yeah, there's actually some like you know paying stuff there. So okay, let's get uh, let's go ahead and let's get another miner in here. So now you can see we have two miners per level. And then our mining machine is going to town. We're doing the things. We're at 12 kilometers already. And as we go down deeper, we're going to get more and more money. And like I said, there's like bosses and like there's all kinds of like upgrades and things like that. So uh, I'm going to let this run for a minute. We're going to come back and we're going to get, you know, we're going to touch on the exciting stuff here. Because like just sitting here watching me play this game isn't going to be the most exciting thing. We want to see the exciting stuff. Now, one thing I do also want to note, actually, is with the um, the the purchasing the craft center. So if I want this copper drill right here, I can click on it. Um, I can see that it only needs money. But then if I want like a double fan or if I want nano cargo, I actually need to have some copper and some silver left over. Uh, and basically, nano cargo is going to allow my storage capacity to go from a thousand to five thousand. So um, sometimes you do actually need resources. And once you get going, you are going to need like a lot more resources. So you don't want to sell everything all the time. Uh, you want to pay attention like your upgrades and what you're going to need but then again you don't need to keep everything either okay so let's go ahead we're gonna get the nano cargo uh just so we can up our capacity to 5,000. craft that bad boy heck yes look at that 5,000. Ooh, baby that's nice and then once we get some more money we'll get some of the other basic upgrades going okay let's get that copper drill drill speed plus 33 percent level two uh base watts is five now it keeps saying base watts is five 
Uh, copper drill was automatically equipped. You can you craft a copper drill. I don't actually see how to uh, to see what my drill rating is. You know, like I don't actually know how to see that trading post. Trade for minerals, chests, and more. Level one trade improvement helps find chests within the mine. Level one metal detector. Level one. So those are like uh, those look like consumable resources. Um, but I don't actually know how to to look at my mine here. Open crafting UI. Is is that all? Maybe there's something else that we're ha we haven't got to quite yet. Oh, we just got a third miner in here. Oh, oh. but now they're getting pricey. Ten thousand dollars. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. Um, and then also another little tidbit is you can see these little blue dots. That means that there's a uh, resource node that I can go and manually mine up and get like a little boost of extra goodness. Oh, what do we got here? Okay, so it looks like we've got something here. Let's wait till this one's done and we'll see what we got going on. I don't know what this part is. Um, Top level. Trade for minerals, chests, and more. Trade level one, trade improvement. We need 800 copper. So we could essentially make... Oh, so we can make a trading post here, but we need 800 copper, a thousand silver and two gold. We have the two gold. Um, we do not even remotely have the silver or the copper. Okay. That's good to know. So we're going to have to get that going. And then what's this? Okay. So basically this whole level right here is for a trading post. Oh, super neat. Okay. So we'll have to get that next. You know what? I'm pretty sure there was an upgrade we could get. Yeah, the double fan drill speed 25% uh, faster. Heck yeah. A two cylinder engine drill speed 100%. Level three base watts five to uh, total watts multiplier is two. We need 2,100. Okay, so I think before that, I'd like to get this thing going. All right, we have enough for our trade posts. Let's go and craft that. So, trading posts, what do you have for me? Uh, you pay 1,000 coal and you get 20 gold. You pay 2,000 copper and you get a basic chest. <laughs> oh! Uh, extend trade. Pay one ticket to extend trade duration. Oh, that is pretty neat. That's actually really cool. Uh, do we want the 20 gold for 1,000 coal? I mean, maybe 2,000 copper. We don't have that. What do I need? Do I need some gold right now, though? Ah, let's make the trade. Okay, there's nobody here. Upgrade your trading post to decrease time between trades. Uh, next trade is in 25 minutes. Okay, so the interesting. I like it. I like it. That's kind of cool. And we got 20 gold, which is actually pretty nice because we've only had two and we haven't had very many. So, And it's upgrade time. Let's get our two-cylinder engine here. That's going to give us uh, drill speed 100%. Because as you can see, we're at 18 kilometers right now. 51%, 52%. 50%. It's a little slow. It's slowing down, right? Exactly. Not anymore. Let's get that a little bit quicker now. Perfect. Okay, so that's going. Looks like the next upgrade is we have a silver drill. Triple fans, micro cargo, four-cylinder, platinum, quad fans, small cargo, six-cylinder, tri-platinum. Partitioned fan and decent cargo. Interesting. Now, we also have different uh, different places. So we're on Earth right now. We don't have our other mines set up yet, but I'm excited to see what those other mines are. So we hit 20 kilometers now. Woo, look at us, big boys, big boys. So I'm going to guess, I wonder if there's like, you know, a special level every like maybe 15, because that was like level 15. So maybe level 30, we'll get another um, special level. Uh, but I think we did get a ticket for that. Oh, we get a chest for that. Oh, six minute time lapse. Oh, that's fantastic. Uh, that would have been nice to know prior to going into that. But that's okay. And then let's see. Do we get anything else? No, I don't really see anything else. Okay. Oh, we discovered platinum. No way. That's exciting. We're about to get our next upgrade too. We're about to get the silver drill. That's going to give us plus 233% drill speed. Um, and I was actually kind of looking through uh, some of these things here. These like achievements. One of them, uh, click an orange fish. Or was it a chicken? Successfully complete an excavation with a 90% higher chance of failure. Um, use the chest compressor. 
So there's like definitely some interesting things here. Robots and friends too. talk to the broken robot. So there's definitely a lot of things in here that just like I'm excited to see as we go along <laughs> what we're really going to find here. Oh, we're ready for an upgrade. Let's go ahead and do this. Let's get the uh, the silver drill. Got that bad boy done. Let's go ahead and hire another worker here. And that should. Yep, that's going to speed us up decently. Now, how are we looking on selling stuff here? So I'm not trying to sell basically the last two items that I have. So we could probably go ahead and sell silver. Yeah, so silver, copper, and gold. We could probably sell those. Looks like we're getting those quick enough now. Uh, or not silver, copper, and gold. Uh, silver, copper, and coal. Gold and platinum, we're not we're not finding that fast. Oh, we got another achievement. 100 gold. Roared basic chest and 5,000. Oh, buddy. Um... I knew it was going to be a five minute time lapse. I knew it was because I, I was over capacity. I wonder if it just like stacks it in there anyways. Okay, so now that we have that, let's go ahead and let's craft up our triple fans. Not two, but three. And then what is the next micro cargo that's going to raise our capacity to 15k? Oh my gosh. 15 platinums required for that? Holy moly. I mean, I have 13. We're actually getting some platinum. Oh, we got a trade. All right, well, we got to trade 81,000 for 91 Colt. No, thank you. 59,000 for a chest. Are you kidding me? You can get out of here with that. Oh, my gosh. And you know what? Of course, it's Karen. Thanks, Karen, for the deal. You suck. Actually, what does it cost to take a new trade? Pay one ticket to get a new trade? No, thanks. Okay, let's get that capacity increased here. Let's get up to 15 yes oh we're big boys now putting on the big boy pants all right so our next upgrade uh 50k 4000 2000 1500 holy moly what is this <gasps> oh we got some uranium value 100 dollars value of holdings 200 dollars. so what do we do with that that's not a sell thing is it no we don't sell that value is a hundred and the value of holding is 200. I wonder what we do with that. So I have two tickets. Let's, let's just, let's just go ahead and spend the tickets. I was going to save them up for the one of these chests, but you know what? I don't even care. Nine minute time lapse. Oh, that was totally worth it. Sell, sell, sell. Uh, let's go ahead and do another one. I bet you it's going to be another time lapse. Seems like that's what they usually are. Eight minute time lapse. Oh, very nice as well. Let's go ahead and sell, sell, and sell. All right. So we've got 61. Oh, wow. That actually helped out quite a bit. Okay. So we've got some upgrades. We could hire more people. I bet you we could probably hire because 25, and then I bet you it's 50 for the next one. Or we could go with a four cylinder engine once we have enough materials here. Oh, the decisions, the decisions. Is it better to get more levels? It probably is. Well, because I mean, each level we're getting four workers. Right now we're at 29. So if I upgrade my miner once, it's going to be 29 more miners. Let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, it's 75,000. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. So you know what? I want another miner. I want another one. We got 77,000. Uh, I basically just sold like through everything. But like every time we get more miners, we're getting things so much faster. So it's almost like the miners are like the best upgrade here. Uh, worker number six. Oh, we dug to 30. Is that anything special? No. Okay. So my assumption that every 15 levels is going to be something is incorrect. So our next hire is 150,000. All right. So I'm going to say that we're probably going to do some upgrades before that. <laughs> oh, yeah, probably. Oh, we can. Act okay, so we can click on uranium and we can click on sell uranium 132, sell uranium 2, uranium 3. Oh, I didn't realize there was a sell isotopes tab. Interesting. I wonder what we need these for, though. Uranium 3 value is 50,000. Oh, my gosh. Um, I don't want to sell those yet because I feel like we're going to need those for like some kind of upgrades or something in the future, you know? It's time for a four cylinder engine on our drill. Let's do it. That will take us beyond 30 kilometers. It, we've been on 30 kilometers for like a while here. It's taken a while now. 
so the platinum drill that's going to drill increase drill speed by 305 percent which would be super nice but we need 50k and we need gold and platinum okay so let's sell everything except gold and platinum actually i have plenty of gold how much gold was it actually maybe i don't have plenty of gold i don't okay you know it's getting to the point where every new floor is exciting because we don't know what we're gonna see all right exactly the same as last time uh oh we got diamonds complete the quest uncut gems oh hello uh we got a ticket for that nice so is that a sell item oh it is a sell item diamond one diamond is 64 dollars. nice i mean that's not as much as the uh uranium like but whoo uranium's getting up there too look at that i like it uh plutonium uranium three we haven't found any of those yet um i don't even know what those are yet all right let's get that platinum drill upgrade and let's go down here do we unlock anything so hey somebody found a chest I got a 10 minute time lapse. Oh, fantastic. Uh, okay. Sell all of that. Your capacity is full. Sell some materials to keep mining. Okay, cool. Oh, look at that. Okay, so do, do we find anything else? So we got to keep an eye on these. So I guess it'll just highlight when, uh, when they find something. Ah, pretty neat. Oh, we got some plutonium two. Wow. We got plutonium two before we got plutonium one. Plutonium 2 is worth 20,000. Oh my gosh, Plutonium 3 is worth 500,000. <laughs> That's some serious catch Okay, um, 36, 35. So, yeah, okay, I don't know. I don't know when we're going to hit another level. Because this was 15. Uh, We're on 36, maybe 40 or maybe 50. I guess 50 would probably be a good mark to, to hit something. And just like that, we've we've got quad fans unlocked as well. Let's get those and then small cargo. We're going to need 50 diamonds. Actually, we're just waiting on the 50 diamonds and then 150 K. Not bad. Did we get anything else in here? We're finding uranium three. Oh, we found uranium three. Oh, that's 50,000. Ooh. Now, I don't know if we want to sell that or not. Oh, there's something here. This requires something we haven't found yet. So we need 50 diamonds and 150 K. Okay. So I need to keep gold, platinum and diamonds. Oh, we got a new trading post, buddy. Kai, if you pay 15,000 gold and get 428,000 copper, you pay 9,000 gold and get raining chest bump, drastically increases the rate treasure chest spawn for 30 seconds. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. 9,500 gold. That's not that much. The only problem is like we would have 30 seconds to do. Yeah, that's totally worth it because 30 seconds, uh, open a chest, time lapse, sell everything, open a chest, time lapse, sell everything, open and basically do that as fast as we can. Uh, and then that could possibly net us like so much cash and so much money. Oh, that could be amazing. Okay. I think we're going to, we're going to try that one. Okay. The time is on us. Let's do it. Um, basically we're going to do this. We're going to make the trade. Oh my gosh. This is gonna be rough. Uh, we had two minutes to spare. We're gonna do this and make trade. All right, sell all. Has anybody found a chest? You? Okay, up here, sell all. You? Up here, sell all. We gotta go through this as quick as possible. Oh, we got building materials that time. Building materials. A minute time lapse. Is that it? Oh, you know what? I wonder if the eight minute time lapse messed up the 30 second. It probably did. It probably did. Ah, that might have been 30 seconds. That might have been 30 seconds. Okay, well, anyways, uh, we're at $632,000 now. So I feel like that was absolutely worth it. Like hands down, absolutely worth it. Okay. 632,000 and we got building materials. Okay. So now as far as all this stuff goes, uh, I need 50 diamonds, which we are actually almost at. There we go. That's going to give us more storage. 50 K much better. 
And then these, we're going to need a lot. We need a lot. Let's go ahead and get... Um, let's go ahead and get another miner in here. Worker number seven. Let's go down here. What do we got? Oh, what is that? That's platinum? Holy moly. All right. And then for our next upgrade, we're going to need 1,000 platinum, 3,000, 5,000, and 20,000. <gasps> oh, my gosh. That's going to take a minute. How long does it say till full? Seven minutes? Is it really only going to take seven minutes to fill the 50K? I mean, it's not going to fill. It might. It might only take that long. Oh, it wants me to craft a manager now. Manages your mind when you're offline and allows you to lock minerals. Level one online offline efficiency is 25%. Oh, that goes 100 diamonds, though. That's fine. So then that can increase. Um, and then metal detector level one. We haven't even found what that is yet. Trading post, trade improvement, zero to 50. Oh, okay. So there's definitely some upgrades we can get there. Okay, let's get this guy. Open this chest. 10 minute time lapse. Holy moly. Um, What did I need for this? Okay, so platinum, gold, silver, and coal. So I don't need copper. So we're still waiting on the coal. Oh, we'll have that here in a second, though. Oh, this is nice. Oh, so now we can lock resources, then hit sell all, and then that way it doesn't include... Hmm, that is actually kind of handy. What do we got for the trades today? 11 Colton for 1.8 million. Wait, wait, wait. We trade 14,000 platinum and we get 56,000 platinum? Oh my gosh. If we had 14,000 platinum, like, why wouldn't you do that? <laughs> That's a horrible trade, my friend. Yeah, payment value is 478,000. Reward value is 1.8 million. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm full again. It's because I need... I don't need copper. I'm going to keep selling copper right now. Because I literally just need... We literally just need like 20k or 2k more coal. I'm going to have to sell something else here. Um, We're going to have to sell... Do I sell the silver? Gosh, coal's like the fastest growing thing. What do I need? Okay, what do I need the least of here? Gold. I only need 3,000 gold. And I have 11,000 gold. But I need 5,000 silver. I have 13,000 silver. I need 1,000 platinum. I have 5,000 platinum. Man, I need like... <laughs> I need to sell a little bit of all of them. Can I sell like just a certain amount? No, I probably can't. All right, we'll sell... We'll sell the silver because I think that's going to be the fastest thing we're going to get. And then also, guess what? We just hit something new here. What is this? Active caves. Any cave that spawn will be listed here. Stored treasure. What is this? Jump to cave building. Basic drone. Click on a drone on the left to upgrade it. Basic drone, magnetic drone, artificial drone. 15 billion, 10 billion, 50 billion, what? Uh, okay, I don't even really know, I don't even know what that's about. Oh my gosh, it took forever. It took finagling because I kept running out of, uh, out of storage space, but we finally got it. Oh, we finally got the upgrade. So our next upgrade is the tri-platinum drill. It's actually... Other than it being six hundred thousand dollars, <laughs> isn't too terrible. Oh whoa! Jump to cave. Hold on. What do we got? Um. Okay. There's a tip. There's no cost to send out a drone. Time remaining. Okay. So how do I? I spend time until full. How do I send out a drone? Basic drone, a basic drone level zero, health 200, total fuel 100, fuel usage 0.8, speed multiplier capacity, magnetic drone, and aerial drone. Okay, so let's do this guy. Basic drone, send drone. Moving through chamber. Oh my gosh, he's like super slow. <laughs> 
A magnetic, magnetic drone won't pull treasure from its own path. Interesting. Go, little drone, go! Go, little drone, go! Look at him go. Oh, moving through the tunnel fuel. 98 of 100 health. Okay, all right. He's doing things. What is this? 324,000. Oh, that's perfect, because that's exactly what I need for an upgrade. Like, that's almost exactly what I need. It's like it's like a couple thousand. It's like 10,000 shy. Okay, we've got collecting treasure. So now can I send this little dude in and explore more? Be careful collecting treasure from hazardous locations. Or does he have to come back now? Hmm. Okay, collecting treasure. Moving through shuttle. Oh, he's on his way back. Okay, cool. Interesting. So then he's going to bring the treasure back. Oh, very nice. Okay, did we still have this guy? Uh, how much time do we have? We have 10 minutes. 14,954 to get 56,000. I don't even have enough storage for 56,000 platinum. Man. That's kind of a bummer. And in 10 minutes, I don't think we're going to hit it anyways. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. Um, 11 Colton for 1.8. Uh, that would be good if I could get more of the Colton. Don't see any, though. So I just realized also, if you click on lock, you can set how much you want a minimum to maintain in here. So that would have been handy when I was uh, trying to get just the resources I need. So like I could have maintained 6,000, 2,200 uh, from the previous thing and sold everything else. <laughs> Darn. Okay, so did he return yet? Almost. And that is $324,000 going into our pockets. Oh, he's back. Okay. 324000 just like that. Wonderful. Wonderful. All right, so now our tri-platinum drill. Let's get that. And then we need to get our partitioned fan and our decent cargo. And then that's it. That's starter blueprint. So I don't know what we get after that. Uh, no idea. Have we unlocked anything else down here? Um, this thing has 17 minutes left. I don't know if I really want to explore deeper in a cave to reveal this node. Time remaining. I don't know. That drone kind of took a while to get over there. So, so if I click this one. Pulls rewards from branching paths to its location. Flying drone avoids land-based obstacles. Total fuel 150, fuel use 0.3, speed multipliers 3. Oh, so this one's only a speed multiplier 1. This is speed multiplier 3, but it can only carry one thing. This can carry nothing? But it pulls it all into a center path, and this can pull three. So, like, this is, like, essentially, like, the little cargo dude. Should we try to throw the aerial drone in there? Let's try it. Let's see what happens. Send drone. Oh, it's way faster. Oh, my gosh. That is, like, so much faster. It's insane. Ooh, radiation damages drones over time. Now, can I call this guy back? Probably not. Oh, that's not good. Boulder must be destroyed to progress. And then what is this? Explore the cave to see further. Interesting. Um, I don't think there's a way to call him back, is there? Moving through chamber. Come back, buddy. Come on. Come back. I don't think there's a way to bring him back. We'll see how much damage it takes from the radiation. All right, it's in the radiation. Oh my gosh. Oh, he came back. Oh, that's because that's as far as we sent him. All right, so, I mean, that's good to know. Boulder, so we're going to have to destroy a boulder somehow. I don't even know how to do that. I'm guessing one of the drones might be able to do that. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm not even sure what drone could handle that honestly oh oh my gosh we have 11 colton to get 1.8 million heck yeah oh my gosh we have 1.8 million we have 1.8 million dollars <gasps> oh hire worker the next hires three million are you kidding me oh my gosh 
Um, that's a million, and we need 25 Colt, which I just, I just sold it all. And then this guy, uh, all I need is 8,000 silver. What are we looking at for silver-wise? Oh, we're at 5,000. We'll get there in no time at all. Okay, so I went through here and I put locks on all of the items to include our last two remaining things here. So uh, I put a lock for, you know, 25 Colton, and 1,000 of those. Um, I did 3,000 platinum because we need 1,000 here, 3,000 of those, 8,000 of those. So now we could go ahead and sell everything and we'll have the resource that we need to finish off our, uh, our last starter things here. So if I go ahead and hit sell all, that should have kept, uh, kept that, kept, yep, it kept everything that we needed. Nice. All right, so here's our partitioned fan. Dunskis. And then this guy, as soon as we get our 25 Colton, we'll be good there. Oh, what are we going to get? Oh, what are we going to get? Uh, This guy. Basic chest and 1.25 million. Oh, my gosh. Nine minute time lapse. Go ahead and sell center. Sell all. Uh, Fantastic. Did we get enough for this? Yes, we did. Craft that. That's it. Decent cargo was automatically equipped. We have no, we have nothing else to craft right now. So I think our next uh, order of business is actually to get to some of these other mines and to get other things going. Oh my gosh, this is super cool. Oh, we did the things. We did the things. Um, how did this go? Nothing there. Nothing here. Okay, cool. And then we also haven't come across any boss fights or anything like that yet. So I'm super curious about those. Craft center. I mean, we have structure. Top level cave. Uh, we haven't found any of these. Oh my gosh. 5,000 Colton. Metal detector blueprint helps find chests within the mine. Level one. Metal detector level one. <gasps> Holy moly. And then we could do drone fuel regen. Max drone fuel. Okay. So there's some upgrades there to be had. Uh, but now it seems like everything is basically going to be... Digging down deeper. Oh, we got a chest. You got scientist James the bear. What? What is this? What? Scientist one, scientist two, scientist three. James the bear level one. Rarity legendary. Metal detect surface. Death chance 0%. Duration 20 minutes. Small mineral pile. Uh, explore shallow cave death chance 4% duration one hour reward pile of building materials oh so they go out and do like expeditions oh that is super cool okay so what to get a legendary uh, scientist fancy pants that is super neat okay so death chance 0% small mineral pile um, let's do the death chance of this one but that takes an hour so we're obviously not gonna stick around for that uh, that is exciting. That's cool. We got that from a chest. So I guess that's something else we need to keep in mind, too. We need to watch out for uh, for chests. Now, it doesn't pull up on here, I don't think. I think it just shows up, like, while scrolling through. Because I don't think... I think the red is the mine. Blue is, like, a, a resource node. So I think just scrolling through is when we can see if we found a chest or not. Oh, my gosh. Super exciting. Uh, but that is actually going to end this first little video of Mr. Miner. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Again, it's completely free. Link down below if you want to check it out on Steam. Uh, I think it's pretty cool. I think it's pretty neat. And again, like there's there's more things coming up. But um, yeah, thank you again for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.